Hello guys and welcome back to another video on the channel today I'm going to be telling you a brand new squad battles glitch where you can stay AFK for the whole game without getting tackled guys this glitch does work on the world class difficulty which is fine because icon swaps are out right now and as you can see these icon swaps are very very good guys as you can see right now you can literally get Prime Moments Kaka, Prime Maradona, Mid Pele it's absolutely insane guys so Doing this squad battle glitch will help you get them players much, much quicker, guys, because you're completely AFK. So, like I said, this glitch does have to be on the world-class difficulty. I'm going to be using a very, very average, if not terrible, team just to prove to you that you can literally do this with any single team in the game, guys. So, I'm going to head into the game right now. I've got a controller overlay on the left-hand side of your screen right now. So, when I'm doing the glitch, if you do not understand anything at any point, just replay it and watch that controller overlay over there. So guys, I'm going to head into the game right now, make sure it's on world class difficulty, and I'll see you then. So guys, as you can see, we are in the game right now. This glitch actually does work on any single scoreline. So what I might do is let them score, just to make my life easier. And doing this glitch, you can be one up, you do not have to be behind. I'm clearly just doing this, just to make my life a lot easier, guys. I don't know how they've missed that. What's going on in goal, just for them. So like I said, you don't have to be losing. You can be 2-0 up, 3-0 up. 4 up, it really does not matter. You can even do it 1 0 down like me if you want to, guys. So, first thing you want to do is head into their box. And when I say in their box, I mean on the edge of their box, guys. Slowly but surely make your way there. Sometimes it's easier if you hit them on the counter attack, catch them off guard. Um, but like I said, guys, I'm using a very, very bad team. So, it's going to be hard for me to do this glitch. So, as you can see, we're passing around nicely here. We do not want to rush our time, lose the ball. And once you're on the edge of their box, it can be anywhere on the edge of their box, on the semicircle D, wherever you want. Um, you're going to get to the edge on the line, basically. And once you're there, you're going to hold the left trigger down, get, their, get them on your back, and run out of their box, continue holding the left trigger. Once you've done that, this is what should happen. They should be running into your back again. I did really say that quickly because I'm trying to do the glitch right now. As you can see, my controller is literally not moving. I'll put it down there, hands free. Um... And basically what I did, I got anywhere, absolutely anywhere, on the edge of their box. As you can see, there's a massive line going through their box where the semicircle attaches onto. You want to get around a meter inside of their box. Hold the left trigger down, guys. That is that one there. And once you held the left trigger down, your back should be facing horizontally to their goal or to where their goal is, that side. Once your back's on that side, you want to walk out, not sprint out, walk out by just moving the left stick to the direction you want to go in. You're going to walk out to around halfway between their box and the halfway line. And then you're going to let go of everything. Once you've let go of everything, this is what should happen, guys. Again, what I want you guys to do, if you guys can't do this right now, is replay that video or when I did the glitch. In 0.5 speed, look at my controller overlay. Like I said, it will be over there. So make sure you look at the controller overlay and redo what I did, guys. It's super, super simple. When you get hold of it, it's post-patch. And, guys, this is probably going to be my last squad battle glitch on the channel because FIFA aren't really patching the game anymore. So it's very, very difficult to find new glitches. So I hope you understand that. Um, please make sure to subscribe if you do find this video useful as we are trying to hit 1,000 subscribers, and if we could do that, that would be absolutely insane, guys. But like I said, hopefully this glitch does work for you. If it does, make sure to like and subscribe, as it will share to more people like you, who may want to do this glitch, especially for the icon swap tokens. Also, I know it only works on world-class difficulty, make sure you're doing it on world-class, by the way, but that really does not matter, because the icon swaps, which are out right now, require world-class. So, guys, it very, very um, works nicely. You can do all your score battle glitches or all your icon swaps in around a day or two. You'll get all the tokens you want. Um, again, you have to do this in the first half and the second half. As you can see right now, it's the 23rd minute. It's been working for a long, long time. I'm probably going to end the video in a few seconds or in a few in-game minutes. Just to prove to you that this does work for unlimited amount of time. Just remember, you, like every other glitch, you're going to have to do this in the second half and first half. But this glitch is much, much easier than any other glitches what have been out or what are going to be out guys so like i said please make sure to like and subscribe i'm going to end the video here have a great rest of your day have a great week and goodbye